how's it going guys it's richie here aka the aquaman um and i'm in my car just about to mask up and go into a new uh, aquascaping store opening here in penmine industrial estate just outside blackwood uh south wales near Caerphilly. um a friend of mine ross is uh op is opening this store uh this weekend uh saturday the 5th of december um it's gonna have no livestock um so it's all your know, wood your rock your sand tanks filters you name it uh he'll pretty much have it here now he's only a small business it's only a small store at the minute um with baby steps so uh let's get inside and take a look at this uh this space okay guys i'll see you in a bit hi guys it's richie here i'm just coming into the shop it's only small at the minute but um yeah we've got plenty of stuff plenty of stuff in here some of this cool corbel catfish roots um little nano tanks or your sands gravels um some seachem products water conditioners and various other bits and pieces we've got your your amtra range some of the heaters some of the filters and skimmers Look at that big piece of corbel root it's awesome this is my favorite piece in the whole shop i wonder if ross will let me steal this piece home with me <laughs> We've got some Dragonstone, Maple Leaf Rock. What else we got? Oh, some of the CJ range. We've got uh, Aqua EL Fish and Shrimp sets. We've got the Aqua EL Ultramax range of filters, which um, I rate, to be honest, perfectly. I, uh, personally, I've used the uh, Ultramax 2000. Uh, a couple of times on a few tanks that I've done for customers and they've worked out really nice um, with some of your Siriu stone look at this piece this piece is awesome I love this piece amazing piece that may come on with me as well not quite sure what this rock is called but I like the uh, I like the white running through it looks pretty cool Okay, now over to this side, we've got more Corbo, more Bogwoods. We've got red more on slate tile, so we don't have to worry about pre-soaking. We've got this other nice, awesome piece. I'm going to call out the Kraken, because I think it looks like an octopus. <laughs> uh, foods, um, test kits, the Aqua EL Leddy Slims which are really good actually so I've been told um, again Amtra tanks you've got the nano you've got the uh, aqua nano tanks 21 litre 36 centimetre tank you've got the other little uh, aqua L shrimp set shrimp set of course all this is going to change it's brand new stores literally not even open so you're having a sneak peek and this tank is so cool the Brio um, so you've got your water side with your fish and this is an aquaponic system so what happens is let me step back so you can see what happens is in this section you have your plants and your fish and shrimp or whatever and then underneath here is a central reserva uh, reservoir with water and of course your fish poo and it goes into the reservoir and in this section you have terrestrial plants that grow out the top um and then it's all controlled you've got light in here which is controlled underneath it by a controller it's not actually turned up yet but this is probably the tank that we're going to use for the workshop that i do here with these guys prodibio nice selection of prodibio tools additives aquaterra plus uh, you've got the starter boxes you've got the soil and the shrimp soil i love this soil um usually comes with a free bacteria kit as well um where whereas most of the other most of the other soils that you buy you'd have to buy that separately which is cool um one of my favorite products 
Piper DPO is the startup. Instantly make your tank safe for fish from day one. And Ross has kindly given me one of these uh, cupboard lights, um, which I think would be wicked for any of you guys that uh, have got um, cupboards. You guys will know how how dark it can be under there when you're trying to do your filter. So, you know, look at that fiver, and you can light up your light up your cabinet. Okay. So that's it for me from uh, Driftwood Aquatics. Um, I'm hoping all you guys in South Wales um, and further afield will, will uh, show Ross and his uh, new shop some love. Yes, I haven't got my mask on. That's because there's nobody here. It's me by myself. So look, I'll spin around. You can see there's nobody here, just me. Ross has popped out because he's hungry. <laughs> so yeah, thanks guys. Thanks for watching the video. Um, hopefully, yeah, ignore the skimmer behind me. Yeah, I don't know even know why that's there, but here we go, it's better. Yeah, so that's it for me, guys. Um, I hope you'll show Ross some love and the shop, and it's only going to grow. So we're starting off small. Um, so as they say, from little acorns and mighty oaks grow and all that. Um, so yeah, hopefully he's just going to get bigger and bigger. So behind, um, there's a wall, this wall behind me. Um, that wall behind me there that will go back and back and eventually uh we'll we not me uh ross will get the whole um the whole unit so yeah watch his space for more tanks he's gonna get more rock more wood um yeah so hopefully we'll get we'll be getting the co2 art stuff in um I keep saying we, it's nothing to do with me, it's Ross. <laughs> I think it's because I'm talking about Ross in this video. So yeah, we'll uh, he'll be getting the CO2 art stuff in. Uh, hopefully some manzanita wood in the future. Um, a couple of other cool tanks, which I can't really tell you too much about at the minute because it's uh, it's a secret. They're not, they haven't even been released on the market yet. So yeah, watch this space. Cheers, guys. Uh, catch you again.